everyone, this is Michelle Swear here. Today we are going to do pumpkin protein pancakes. And this can you can vary these ingredients however you like. We're going to use just a fourth of a, um, four ounces of egg whites. And, and this recipe is a serving for one person. We're going to do a third a cup of oats, a third of a cup of pumpkin. And if you want to su substitute, you can substitute pumpkin for applesauce or something else that you might like better. But for me, I love the pumpkin. And then we're going to add in a scoop of vanilla protein. It's really important on your protein powder. Um, no hormones preferably, no uh, artificial sweeteners. They're really bad for you. And so just keep it really, really clean. Um, we'll do a half of a teaspoon of a pumpkin spice to give it you know, some of the flavor that we want. And then we're going to take and we're just going to whisk the whole thing together. It's very simple, takes literally seconds to make, so it's not going to take you a long time to do this. Now I decided to add another scoop of protein powder because it was a little too watery for my likings. So if you would like your pancakes more fluffy, then you can add a little bit more protein powder. So add as needed to your own personal preference. Now this is about where I like it. So next, I'm gonna use butter. Now some people, um, I happen to not have a problem with butter. I think there's some benefits that I use to heal the gut, and so I'll use an organic butter. Um, you can use coconut oil, or some people like to use those sprays. I don't really care for them because of the propellant and some of the other toxins that are in them. So I would rather use a little bit of butter than have the propellant toxins. So we're gonna use a little bit of butter, just lightly butter, and then add your mix. And you can probably do a couple different pancakes. You know, some people might wanna do just one pancake, one big one. Um, I like a few extra. And we're gonna cook this. I like an electric skillet for me because it just seems like my pancakes come out better. <laughs> you can use on the stove if that's what you prefer to do. So we're going to let this cook and rise and then we'll flip it over. Now if you want to cook this on the stove, you probably want to cook it under a medium heat because you don't want it too high because you don't want it to get burnt on or you know, too cooked on the outer parts and then it'll be raw in the middle. So medium heat is where I would go. Okay, so we're going to try and flip it over. I want to make sure it's done. I don't like my pancakes burnt. I'm a little bit weird about that. So it's nice and brown here. And this is about done. Make sure we get buff. And, and what's nice about these is you can see that it's even getting a little bit fluffy just like a normal pancake would. A lot of people have a hard time giving up breads and all these kinds of things or they feel like they're being deprived. And what's nice about some of these recipes is, I've, you know, I've gotten to a place where I actually prefer this over, you know, some of the standard stuff. With this, you can actually, um, I like people to use Lohan. Lohan is a low glycemic sugar. Uh, it comes from a fruit. And what's great about it is this, actually when you buy it as a liquid, it kind of almost tastes like syrup. And so you can use that on your pancakes and that way you're not getting the insulin response. And so we'll put our pancake here. And we're ready to go. And like I said, you can use Lohan on it if you'd like. Um, like I said, this is great to have. You can get, I get mine off of Amazon. Uh, this one is great because you can carry it in your purse if you need to, if you want to use it for like uh, the, you know, if you're using teas or whatever it is that you like to use sweeteners, this is a great way to, to, to use it because you're not going to get the insulin response, you're not going to um, get the toxins from the artificial sweeteners, and so this is a great substitute. That's your protein pancakes in five minutes or less. Have a great day, everyone.